ELISA is an abbreviation of enzyme-linked immunosorbent assay and utilizes the bond between an antibody and its specific antigen in order for it to work. There are four main types of ELISA. Direct ELISA, indirect ELISA, sandwich ELISA and competitive ELISA. Today we will look closer at sandwich ELISA which is carried out in the following manner. First, capture antibodies specific for the target analyte are bound to the floor of a micro well plate. Second, the sample is added and any antigens present in the sample that are specific to the capture antibodies bind to them. Then the well is washed to remove all unbound sample components. Third, enzyme conjugated antibodies, which are also specific to the target analyte, are added, which bind to the antigens on the target analyte. Finally, substrate for the enzyme, which is linked to the second antibody, is added and the enzyme convert this substrate into an observable signal. This means that if the target antigen is present, it gets bound by the capture antibody. Then the enzyme conjugated antibody can bind to the target analyte yet again and in its turn produce a signal once the substrate is added. This produces a positive test result. If the target antigen is not present, however, this prevents the enzyme conjugated antibody from binding to it, which in turn produces a negative test result since the enzyme which converts the substrate is not present. In other words, if a color change occurs, it is interpreted as a positive test result, and if no color change occurs, it is interpreted as a negative test result. If you want to understand competitive ELISA just as quickly, check out this video. Until next time.